Hello YouTube fans, welcome to another uh, exciting review I've got for you right now and uh, today we'll be looking at the Legacy Bombshell Right, there he is in his box I, uh, As you can see I have opened him up yeah, Just to check him out but I got this bad boy from uh, Forbidden Planet today for $24.99 That's £24.99 So, without further ado, let's just jump right into it And have a look at him So, he comes with a manual Instruction um, Yep, yeah, it's just folded up pieces of paper And uh, yeah just uh quite straightforward transformation that's the i say that's back front there you go have a good look and here he is here he is, here he is. Yeah. Take a good look at this one. Now, I've heard reviews that, um, well, yeah, well, it's true, I think it is true. The, the mold on his legs are the same mold as this guy here, Shrapnel. So, um, if you wanted something different, uh, we're not gonna. They didn't give us that, but uh, the upper upper half of the of the mold is yeah definitely bombshell. But the the second second half is basically the same as shrapnel. Now, at the back here, we've got his gun. Where, uh, as you know, already know. The Karatomi takes so much pride in uh, packaging the accessories like this. So let's have a look at this before I unstrap Bombshell. And all it is is just a piece of paper wrapped in uh, paper, a mache paper with that. Okay, wrapped it with um, sellotape. So he's got one piece here. This is probably the top part of your gun. We've got another piece. And the third piece. So there's three pieces in the total to Bombshell's gun. We've got two black uh, cannon pieces and the head. There you go. Now, I assume that the black pieces go into the circular bits there. So I'm going to try assemble it now. And show you. It's, a, it's quite straightforward. The thing is with these figures here from Legacy, I mean, um, yeah, they're not hard. Well, it's not rocket science to say the least, yeah. I just put two, I would say three, together and you pretty much can suss it out for yourself. Huh? So that's quite a nice uh, piece of weaponry. It's a painted, well, silver I guess, or me metallic, and the black is just plastic. So, that's the gun. That's Bombshell's gun. There you go. Now, let's release Bombshell from his cage, prison, whatever you want to call it. I, for one, I'm going to be very careful about how I separate these wires 
Notice I cut away from the figure. So I don't cause any, you know, scratching of any sort. Oh, we've got one more here, right up by his antenna. Oh, why do they... I'll do it on this side. Right, just did it. There you go. And uh, that works as a background piece as well. Should you or would like to use that? Right, there you go. So much for that. And um, yeah, once again, if you want to look, there you have uh, at the box. Look at the box. We've got you know, the obligatory some artwork on the side. Uh, Beetle bombshell at the front. Legacy Evolution. And um, and rightly so, these guys have come a long way and they have evolved, to say. So, he doesn't seem to come with any uh, spare parts like the other two. Because the other two have, uh, like here's Kickback, he came with these plasma energy, uh, sort of like bubbles. Uh, well, not bubbles, but... Plasma energy, kind of like, um, well, shallons or whatever they are. And, um, and here, yeah, Shrapnel, he, he, he came with these little skates that, the, that you can, you know, plug in when he's in, um, well, insect mode as well. But uh, I, I prefer to have him on his feet because it gives him extra height. But bombshell. Just came as he as he as he is. So let's take a good look at him. So, um, so it's like mainly black plastic on the legs, and I believe that's purple plastic on the chest, body, um. Yeah, uh, it's a yellowish. Is that fluorescent? Yeah, fluorescent like abs. It's a see through plastic, is what I mean. And uh, yeah, it's a nice tint of uh, like uh, metallic yellow going on in there. You can see. Yeah, with the uh, Decepticon insignia in the middle. And check out his uh his face. I mean, his uh his eyes. Those eyes. They are deep, deep red. Pretty cool. I like that. So in comparison size. One, two. Yeah. Here he is from the side. At the back yeah yeah sorry guys I don't really have the rotating machine so uh, we do it manually here all right let's have a look and see what we can do with this guy um, boom let's see if we can try and transform him let's try And uh, let me see. Right. Oh, yeah. It, the waist goes 360 all the way around. You've got to turn that when you want to get him into bug mode. Um, I'm trying to figure this out without actually looking at the instructions. Because, I mean, how hard can it be, right? And we're back, and here he is. Look, there you go. Bombshell. 
in his bug mode and he was pretty straightforward quite straightforward to do actually there he is in his um bug mode glory and he looks fantastic i like the details on him especially where the eyes are or that's where his shoulders are yeah his the simple transformation is basically there is his head uh originally and you just flip it over cover bang okay well that's the three of them well there's bombshell kickback and shrapnel mission completed these are the dis inceptacons i was going to say decepticon inceptacons but here are the Inceptacons, the trio, all completely collected. Alright, thanks for watching guys. Hopefully I'll catch you on the next review. Uh, sorry, it's a bit of a, um, you know, bit of a sham, but hey, we've got to start somewhere, right? Alright, peace out and have a good one. Keep collecting.